All right, short little tutorial on how to encode. Um, I'm going to show you using Adobe Media Encoder instead of um, you know just adding it to the render queue and exporting it out of After Effects. We're going to do it all through Adobe Media Encoder. And yes, I'm a pervert. Two girls kissing here. Just a little experiment I'm doing. I always notice on YouTube that like hot girl clips and clips that look like it's a naked girl or something always do really good and they just like put it in the thumbnail to trick you so I was going to try one and see what happens um, they're my girlfriend her cousin and her wife they're married okay so like I said instead of exporting we're just gonna save the project and I'm actually gonna quit Photoshop to free up some I mean uh, After Effects to free up some memory and we'll go find the project here on my video raid And I'm going to delete all these outputs from earlier. Okay. So we'll import the composition. Mm, it's called kissing. Okay. And now the neat thing that you can do here that you can't do in After Effects is, let's say, hold on. So say you wanted to do like for an I, you know, iOS device, they, they require like four or five different renderings at different bit rates and stuff. So here you can do it all at once. Um, I'll just show you using YouTube examples. So we can do like a YouTube 1080, yeah, 720, and a 360, and a 480, just for good measure, all at the same time. You can even throw, we'll even throw in a Vimeo 720. And then you can just hit export. And it does them all at the same time in parallel. You can see it's, it's taxing my system pretty good. Um, so I'll look these in code and I'll get back with you in a minute. And no, as, as you can tell, here it's using um, all of my processors to encode the video. And if you look up here at uh, iStats menu, you can see it's taxing all my processors pretty good. So here we are. Uh, they all encoded. It took about five minutes or so. Um, and really, that's all there is to it. Uh, you can see here we got five different we can stay with them. outputs that easy see you later All right, <clears throat> here's a walkthrough on uh, setting up a Rackspace cloud server uh, with LAMP stack, and I'm going to install WordPress, mm, probably Webman maybe, maybe Virtualman. I don't know, we'll see. It's been a while since I've set one up, so I'll walk there with you. Um, I'm not following any guides, so um, I might get stuck in a place or two. Okay, we're gonna do server one. I'm gonna use Ubuntu 12.10. And then it's just a small one. And create. And don't forget to get the password. All right, then um, I'll let that build and I'll get back with you.